Hello everyone and welcome back to Beckett and Plays Hearts of Iron 4 with their death or the Sonar expansion. We're back with Democratic Czechoslovakia taking part in the war in the east against the Japanese who, after several nukes, the last one on their makeshift capital of Nagoya, they are really low to con they're really close to capitulation. Which means that it's all more important to take out as many as as many Japanese as we can. We've been pushed back to Hiroshima once again, and we're surrounded, but that has left open holes for the attack over in Tokyo, over up in the north in Amori, and not in the south in Nagasaki. That got pushed back again. But things are going well, especially since there's so many Japanese to defend their own islands. We are able to do some damage to them up here in the north in the Russian lands. So let's finish up our attacks. We got men walking away. Let's go and help this assault. All in, boys, all in. Gonna have to defend off their advances. We got a pretty wide line to make sure nobody does any moves against us. Hmm. It's not looking good. Why is that? They are... They have pretty high strength, but they're low on organization, just like we are. Alright, let's get some new tech. I don't know, more battleships? Light cruisers? This is not going to affect us in any way. Uh, how about advanced landing craft? Basically, we are in a post-technology era. We don't care what happens in technology anymore. Let's hold there. And if I control click? No. If I shit. If I... What happens? Come on. Control, right click. Yes, thank you. There we go. Hmm. Uh, what if I control right click there? There we go. We got support divisions. They'll come in. I'll make it one last province. No airplanes in there that, that we can know of. Okay, things are going good. Outdated equipment. Still just the rifles, but that's all right. It's perfectly fine. We can have those old rifles. Let's check down here again. Yeah, we're holding out all right. How's our light tanks? Actually, we've always had quite a lot of light tanks throughout the war. Probably should have just went with light tanks instead of going for modern tanks. They don't seem to have ever done anything for us. Move in, please. What the hell? You, move in. You, move in. Finish the job you started. There we go. That's better. They got a couple of probing attacks with the Japanese around Kaborovsk. But for the most part, that's fine. And looks like they've been overrun over in the salient. Good, we've pushed our lines. Not a lot, mind you. I mean, we were probably... We were here, and now we're here. If that gives you an idea of how little that campaign actually was worth. As for you, just march into no man's land. No one's taking this land. Let's meet up with the Russians and British over in the Vladovska uh, salient. Finish this fight. You guys, they're on the last leg, I'm sure. If we just take any of your... Hmm. If you take any of the victory conditions, one victory point there. Hmm. Let's do what we do best. Take over land where they leave us alone. They've been trying to make a push to take Kochi, which is worth 10 victory points. Now that's interesting. Okay, back to the north. Back to our slow, methodic war in the north. They are leaving Kabor. Kaboras. Kaborovsk. Kaborovsk. Yeah, it just, 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 just does not work. Alright. Forget what you did. We just need to push. Hmm? Do that. Do all of that. No. You just need to push to right there. Do you think you can do that? Sure, it says come from the center of the line, but we know where we know where the meat of, of this is. Try for it. Try it. Go ahead. Day bombing has been achieved. Okay, we can bomb during the day. All of our airplanes are in India anyway. They're not going to help me here. 
Push forward. Take the last little bit. We got this. Cut them off. <clears throat> eh, they're probably gonna move there before I can, but that's alright. So we're going down this street. Fighter escorts. Got some of them good escorts. So we have taken land, but they've cut us off for being able to take Koichi. That's fine. I'm fine with this. We've taken the majority of Korea. We've taken a good part of China. We got a couple months left until that coup. 25th of June. Coming in one of the southern provinces to really try and connect up with us, because I would I would be amazed if that didn't join in on the Allies immediately. Then we can use that to basically take over all of China. Like, just like we did with the Russian Federation taking over all of the Soviet Union. By the way, how you doing? Manpower is very low. It's on extensive conscription, but you have 234 divisions. Nice. Hmm, our attack here being supported by the Russian tanks. It's going pretty well. Hey, they've abandoned this ground. Move forward. Our attack up in Kaborsk, not being supported by Russian tanks. Uh, what, what can you do? Let's see what's happening here. So a light tank division, commanded by Vladislav Ivan Kanov, only skill one. We are low supply, we are low morale, we have a, ter we have a terrain penalty, and they can pierce the enemy divisions who are light tank. Enemy air superiority, yeah, we pulled out of the fighting because of that. I see. I see how it be. Push down this way. See how this fighting goes. We're just out. We just don't have the supply to do this. Hmm. We're facing attacks, but every attack they send our way just digs their hole deeper. Oh, Jesus. This was at 11 million last episode. Now it's at 4.27 million at highest. That is horrific. Okay, updated. Let's look at the war picture. Uh, you haven't really lost that much. Maybe maybe the numbers have gone down due to... It has to be due to a, lo a loss of territory instead of just death. That's got to be it. They've lost their territory and they don't have the same manpower, manpower reserves that they used to. It's the only thing that makes sense in this world. Let's use this force to support. Oh, I could have supported that. Oh well. Oh damn. The Russian tank divisions are here and they're ready to fight. So damn many of them too. Ah, uh, the Amari front. Was really starting to bulge Tokyo front. Nice, strongly held. Even some... Ooh, Osaka had been landed on and taken by the French. We fought so hard to take that land, and we got it. I love it. What does that mean for the war? 94% they were at 93. So we're very close to seeing white flags. Push in wherever we can. Force the point. No, not gonna work there. No, no please, no. Let me stop let me stop this combat. Game, please. Hmm. Airplanes in reserve. Oh, we did just capture something. We got a lot of fighters. Send some in. <clears throat> Shift click to get a hundred. Nope, they're being overrun. We can go here though. Yeah, something along these lines. Get a hundred close air support too. Put that in here to help us fight. Good, good. We lo we had a defeat. Hmm, that's odd. Defeat of our supplies, probably. That would explain why we're so just die. We're just dead. Bad supply. Hmm. Supply areas. Oh uh, yeah, it's coming through here. 
It's just, just bad. We cannot hold it. I could take nine troops, but the Russians are here too. Just ain't enough. What about somewhere else on the line? No, they got good forces everywhere else on the line. Even Spanish forces in some places. That's impressive. Yeah, we're not pushing it through them. Let's just begin that those troops are not in the combat. Okay, air wings with no mission. Over Japan, please. Do some air superiority missions. Uh, we seem to be at a loss. Come up here, then. Do the same thing, but up here. Away from everyone else. Where you're not really of any use. Air superiority over Japan. That'd be lovely, thank you. Could do the same over the sea. We seem to have some problem with that. Air map mode. Hmm. That's pretty much used. Oh. Huh? You have yellow hold order, but that's because, well, you don't really have anything to do. Push forward? No. It's mostly just defend. I just want you to defend. Hmm. What's the problem? Interception? I could go see a Japan. They'll just be shooting down their aircraft. Hmm. We want to push in. Help out the Russians, please. Let's see. So we're coming in in support. We got the air superiority. We got the encirclement. We got the encryption, decryption advantage. But we are weak. We have low supply. We just don't have anything to do. Let's hope it's enough to break through them. They have... 140 soft attack. We have 261. They have... 530 defense. We only have 97. But we did it. We made it. We have done it. And we have insufficient resources. Because of course we do. We're getting it from the Russian Federation. And they are a bottomless pit of steel. So let's go. Old stuff is old. Air wings with no mission. Hmm. I don't have coverage over this region, you say. Okay, then. Not really any place I can take them. At least not here. Not in this region. Uh, everything is overcrowded everywhere else. What the... F what? 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 Oh, you were all the way over there. You needed a location. Oh. Oh my. That's why. Okay, good to know. So we have our cutoff of the Japanese forces here. We know who's there. And, yeah, we can see them again. We can see what we're up against. And it feels good. So now we can encircle their forces. We have the Ladova stock basically done and dusted. What to do, what to do, what to do. Have I gone through everything in land doctrine? We have. Have I gone everything in air? We have not. But I don't care, so that's fine. Spend 24 days designing a new fighter I'm not going to use? Sounds like time well spent. <coughs> hmm... As for you guys, got one mission for you. Take there. And, oh, we got some attacks on the line. And we're pushing them back. Oh, damn. Some of our troops aren't even uh, starving anymore. That's incredible. Go this way. Do the attack from here. Everyone in. All in, boys. All in. There's not even anyone in the city. Just move in. Come on. What is the sandwich hour? Japan has capitulated. Mmm. Capitulated to France, ironically. But they fight on. What keeps this war going then? Reorganized. Huh. 
Reorganized nationalist China is what's continuing this war. Well, it's a good thing, it's a target of a coup, that April, May, June, that in a couple months, we'll be destroying their morale by having a civil war in, I don't know, Sichuan? Was it Sichuan Chicken Sauce Morty? Sichuan. Is that where I'm sending it? No, in uh, wind, spreading revolutionary wind from Jinji, which is right on the border. Let's hope we don't push too far in. Let's hope they can actually hold off with their forces for a little bit. For a couple months, please. Please. It's the only way. Heh, <laughs> Greece is even here. Oh, Greece, Manchuria. We all know the stories. So our soldiers, we've survived by the skin of our teeth. Let's move into Nagoya. Take out what we can. <clears throat> Most of their line is just completely collapsed. Offensive line. Yeah, sure, how about a big old offensive line? We can go back to being aggressive. They still have some of their troops, but they're not. They are rebellious troops. Some decided to lay down their arms, some didn't. It's to be expected. Now I'm hoping for a massive push into Manchuko. Finish this war out strong. It's mostly reorganized nationalist China that's going to be the problem now problem child and holy shit did they make Iwo Okinawa a massive province have I noticed this before like this is just a couple of small islands and they're making it to be like the size of Taiwan holy shit that is that's that's an odd art direction ah this is good Dutch East Indies taking back a lot of their Japanese holdings hmm Winds of change. Unassigned divisions, you say? Well, in that case, join up. Join the forces. Let's, uh... With this force, the new conquerors, let us move against the... Chinese, I guess. They can come in and try to take Chongqing. Outdated equipment. Yeah, same stuff. Naval stuff, naval stuff. Dad, oh, that's a, those are my things. Oh. Let's just get rid of it, though. Let things play out the way they're meant to. Could send some of my troops to... Yes, I could send some of my troops to help out in the Dominion of India. That should be just in a wash. There's no one there to defend. It'd definitely help out after all the attrition suffered up in the north. But uh, they can do that after they take Manchuko. I'll have these forces take do the fighting against the Chinese. Their first their first mission to go against Wuhan, Wuhan, or Zhengzhou. Where would be a good place to first strike? Nan Nanchang. I'd like to keep it out of the Zhejiang province if at all possible. Because we got a couple months left. We got like one month left. May, June? Yes. How goes the invasion? Slow going, but just because we're walking there. We're walking to invasion. We can move our flyers out of here. We had 100. Land in East China and fight there. That's the plan. Just go there, you know, have fun. Be yourself. Port strike, you know, do all the fun things. Yeah, but come here, though. There you go. You're flying. You got this. I believe in you. Eastern Front has its issues. Mmm, it's nice to see our... It's nice to see that grow. After all... After all this strife of being locked up around this area, it's nice to push in so heavily. Details, I want to know details. <clears throat> close air support could be... We haven't done anything with close air support since the beginning of the war. We should fix some of that. Good, that's going away. And now we wait for the next coup d'etat. I really could use a force to help out in India, but I don't. And we're out of time for this video today. Thank you for watching. 
I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!